Hey guys, MLE here, Malas Envy, doing another unboxing, this time of the Ultrasone HFI 15G. Uh, these have been out for oof, maybe over 10 years or so. Um, I bought them because I have the, 15, the HF, HS15, which is a headset variant, a closed version, which uh, a friend of mine, Calpis on HeadFi, sent to me. And I really love their comfort and just, I can wear them all day. And I, and I enjoy their sound. They're not, you know, they're not amazing, but they're, they're pretty good. Now, these are basically the same, just open. And they cost, they cost quite a lot of, quite a bit more, but they're a little bit more hard, they're harder to find. These is, these have been discontinued. You can still find them on eBay and some other sites, but yeah, I wouldn't, just be careful <laughs> when you try to buy them. Because uh, they're kind of, they're kind of hard to find. Anyway, let's get started. Got the S Logic HFI. What kind of goodies come in here? Got an extension cable. Looks incredibly long. The the HS15 has a really long cable. Let me show you right here. Yeah, I had to tape it up with ghetto ghetto tape for now, but it is incredibly long. Look at the the boom microphone is humongous, but they're super comfortable. I could wear them all day. Oh, buddy. Okay, nothing else in the package. They look basically identical to the uh, to the HS15, but without a without a boom microphone, and it's semi open. Which, as if you know me, you know I love my semi open headphones. The pads are cloth; they're on ear, but I'm telling you, these are probably the most comfortable headphones I've ever worn. All right, it's all plastic. Even though it looks a little cheap, I'm telling you right now, you could. These will survive basically anything. It is incredibly well, uh, the design is well made. It's got a pleather headband, doesn't bother me because, you know, I don't really feel it on my hair. These are incredibly light. One of the lightest headphones I've ever owned. Okay, the cable looks to be around four feet. I was told by my friend Calpis that there is a second, ver there is another version of these headphones that have gold lettering here and it comes with an ex incredibly long cable which I would not doubt considering my HS15 has a very unruly cable the cable's not detachable I mean this is a very old headphone it looks, it looks to be around three and a half feet long maybe shorter maybe three feet but good thing there's an extension cable and I have my own anyway nice travel I think it looks pretty nice. Um, it has a, a ULE, which is ultra low emission, I believe. And what that does is it lowers the decibel decibel rating by quite a bit. And to me, I found I found the I found the HS15 to be very hard to like hard to drive to like a loud volume. So you will want to pair either of these up with an amp. Here's the dif here's the differences. I much prefer the cable on the on the 15G since it looks like a standard cable instead of this old home appliance style cable. I know what I'm getting into, uh, considering how comfortable these are and the kind of sound they output. It'll be it'll be kind of bassy on the warm side, with uh, just a, a little bit of a treble peak for some for some uh, clarity in the upper range but it's mostly a non-fatiguing headphone which is great because I want to be able to wear it all day anyway just a short unboxing of the Ultrasone HS HFI 15G S Logic uh, one more thing to, to note is that these are very what you call it they need a very ideal ear placement so you might want to might want to experiment how to put them on your ears because they, the sound will vary Anyway, that's it guys. See you later.